Right now, our manager is doing too much. On top of providing streams and receiving data through syncs, it also does this validation part. It's an ambitious manager and uh, there's nothing worse than an ambitious manager. So we should change that and our manager should have a single responsibility. So single responsibility is this principle in programming that every part of your code, uh, such as function or module or class, should have responsibility over a single point in your program. And everything related to that should be inside that entity. In our case, managers are supposed to be clueless. They should just pass messages from widgets to other services and vice versa. That's the responsibility for managers, providing those streams and receiving the incoming data. Clueless managers, almost like in real life. In order to achieve that, we will uh, create another class, or rather not a class, but um, a module, we could say, which is meant to add features or functionalities to other classes, to enhance them, to extend them with, uh, with other things. So this is known as a mixin. So it exists in Ruby, it exists in Dart, of course, and any other programming languages as well. And you could also use a class here, but if you specify a mixin, if you use the mixin keyword, you are being more explicit because it means that you won't be able to create an instance of that entity of this mixin. So mixin shouldn't be created, it should only be added to other classes so that when those other classes are created, the features, the functionalities included in that mixin are also included in those instances. So in our case, it's pretty simple. We will just grab those two parts, which don't belong here. And simply we will pass them over here. We need to import some things. That's pretty good. So now here our class, which will be just using the validation. We are including this as a mixin and the errors disappeared. Let's see if it works. There is an error whenever I type an ampersand, the error disappears. So our manager is now clean and clueless. On top of that, it does only one thing. And now we can extend that to other fields. We can include those other fields here and try to do more comprehensive, a more comprehensive validation. And we will do that in one of the next episodes. Stay tuned.